Terminators with white faces? Come with me if you want to live. Time for another Necron painting update. Necron! Nick speaking, and welcome to this video. Right, another Necron painting update. I've done a load more work, I'm really excited to show you. Before that though, if you would like to keep up to date with the wonders of Warhammer 40K, then please give me a sub and hit the bell button so you don't miss an upload. Okay, so yes, I've been painting the tray of Necrons once again this week. Uh, done a load of work, mainly painting white with a few other bits and pieces as well. Uh, so the white, I have been doing uh, several coats, as you probably can imagine, so about five coats of white, just to build up the, the layers and make the white really, really nice and smooth. Uh, so let's have a look at that and the rest of the work that I've done right now. Okay, so here is the tray of Necrons. Let's take a look at what I've been doing. Okay, so first of all, we have the Warriors. Now I'm gonna be using these as Immortals with Tesla. So I've painted them as much as I can to match in with my Immortals that I currently have. So that is White Faces. It's quite interesting, there's a variety of sculpts actually within this uh, batch of Warriors. So they all have slightly different faces, but I just try to match them in the best that I could. I've also painted just the rim of their uh, like collar section as well with gold, just to introduce a little bit of gold uh, into these guys. So these are almost finished, I still have to do the eyes, and I still have to do the chest plates, uh, which I'm going to paint the little symbol in green, and I'm going to do like a little glowing effect. Uh, but yeah, really happy how they're looking so far. Right, let's have a look at what else I've done. Okay, so next are the destroyers. So once again, I've gone in with the white and the gold. In actual fact, these guys here are finished, so I've still got to do their bases, of course. Uh, but in terms of painting the models, they're done, so that's really pleasing. Uh, let's have a look then and see what else I've also done. Right back to the Praetorians. Uh, so I went in, I was going to paint white faces on these guys, which is how my pariahs are, because I'm trying to match these into my pariah models. Uh, however, when it came to paint the face, uh, I realised that the head is recessed quite deeply into the neck, and it's really difficult to get to the bottom section of the face. So um, I decided, in the end, to just paint their crests white. And actually, I th I'm really happy with it. I think it works really well. So I've now got a white crest rather than the face. But uh, like I said, I'm happy how it's looking. Now I've still got a lot of work to do on these guys. I've still got to do their chest plates. I've got to do their tabards. There's a few more little green areas that I've got to paint, and of course, I've got to paint their eyes. Uh, so there's still quite a bit to do on these guys here, but uh, they're coming along quite nicely. And I have finished some of the other bits and pieces. So first of all, the shields. Uh, went in, painted uh, a white symbol in the end. Uh, I thought it would be quite a nice contrast to the green orb. Uh, and then I did some extra gold sections around it. And then finally I did some black areas just on the uh, little outside sections. Let me just pick one up and show you a bit closer, because you can't really see it at that angle. That is how that's looking. So next is the swords. I uh, went in on that base coat of green that I originally had from the last video, uh, and I painted scorpion green on top of that, trying to make them look like green rods. Uh, several coats, about five coats of that paint, just to build up the colour. Still got to paint the little symbols on there, but uh, they're almost done, uh, along with the little staff section. So obviously these are magnetised, uh, so these will be the rod and also the war sign. Uh, so I painted the little grip area black, because that's how my Praetorians are. Uh, not much more to do on them, again just the little symbols to do on that little energy section. So on this little blob here I haven't actually done anything. Uh, all I've got left to do are the symbols once again, just on the top of the, the rod and also the war sign. Um, so not too much more to do on those sections there. Uh, the characters, which I've got at the moment just off of the tray, just over there, I haven't done anything to them, so I'm going to be working on those last. My plan is to finish all of these guys here first, so I'm going to work on the warriors and uh, also the little uh, accessories for the Praetorians next, then I'm going to finish the Praetorians, and then I'm going to work on the characters. So I'm doing really well, but I do still have more work to do. So watch out for the next video. Beam me up.